you can also look at distributions of demand comparison information such as the amount of excess generation so where generation has exceeded demand at any point in time or residual uh, in this case I'm looking at excess um, so we have a, a percentage plot and this is showing you the uh, the distribution of this excess production so for this 100 megawatt scenario we're still getting an excess at some points in time in fact at one point our excess even goes up to 450 megawatt hours in a day these are all daily daily statistics um, but then if we move down the chart we'll see that 50 percent of the time approximately there is no excess 20% of the time there's an excess of um, uh, 85, at least 85 megawatt hours or more. Um, so this gives a bit of distribution. So starts to feed discussions about, well, what do we do about this excess? Do we change demand? Do we change storage? Do we curtail? Do we throw it away? Um, again, we can go and if you click on the chart, it will take you through example weeks or days which have those particular characteristics. Um, I'll just build that back up again. Uh, there we go. So we can navigate to extreme or typical, uh, extreme or typical uh, situations of demand and, and download that data and look at it.